the trade deadline is fast approaching in the NBA. And what better way to, you know, get it started off and stuff like that than, I don't know, than something crazy like the, um, the rumors that have been starting, you know, there's the 76ers that, that are, you know, the Philadelphia 76ers, we all know how it's been for them and recently, and then, you know, now they're good again, but now they're interested in guys like the Timberwolves, Robert Covington, you know, and they're, and this is going to be one hell of a, one hell of a trade deadline, um, Bogdanovic, you know, he, he could be coming into Philadelphia. He could be. Um, but, yeah, there is a couple of injuries going on with the injury bug and stuff like that. Um, for the 76ers, Josh Richardson sideline with a left hamstring strain um, for now. Um, this happened yesterday, so he'll be out. Um, there's all sorts of questions coming in to Saturday's game which is going to be the Lakers at the 76ers. This will be the first matchup of the season, the only time, for these two teams at least. This will be the only time that the Lakers will come out to Philadelphia this year as the Lakers play in the West, Philadelphia plays in the East. And, you know, it's been it's been a long time coming. You know, a matchup like this, it's going to be one hell of a matchup, I guarantee you. Um... Frank Bogle, Lakers coach, LeBron James, of course, you know, trying to get through to the Lakers, you know, they're they're playing good right now, but can they, you know, can they finish it off, you know, can they finish it off with a championship this time around? Um, and the Lakers are trying to prove that by, you know, flexing their muscles and stuff like that against some damn good competition, and it's going to be one interesting game, um, Last time I saw the 76ers was on Christmas, and they did not look the greatest. They got actually they looked way better than Milwaukee. Yeah, it was it was one it was a crazy team. Let me tell you that. But that was the last time I saw the 76ers, and of course, I saw the Lakers last week, last week's game against Houston um, on Saturday night. So of course. This is the Saturday night game for um, the prime, the primary package of, of ESPN and ABC, and we are, you know, just excited to see another good matchup. Of course, there was the whole thing last Saturday with um, Conor McGregor, um, and how that fight in 40 seconds, but we're not going to talk about that. Um, but, you know, it's going to be another interesting game. We'll see what the Lakers' defense can do. They had the clamps on Houston in the second half. Can they do this again? Um, we'll find out. We'll find out on Saturday night. And it's going to be interesting. 7.30, of course, you know, is when this game will be played. And it's going to be fun, man. I am excited. But are you excited? Um the Sunday game, the Sunday games return next Sunday, so that'll be Super Bowl Sunday, so there'll be a, a doubleheader preview for both games next week. Um, sorry that there's only one game uh, again this week, or rather, this is the only game this week, but, you know, um, it is what it is. Um, I could just talk about the NBA in general, but there hasn't really been too much happening, um, aside from trade rumors, and this game being hot price propped up as something huge. Um, and of course, there were a couple of things that happened with the injuries and stuff, especially to my Dallas Mavericks. Um, a bad injury that happened, you know, uh, you know that you know, the Achilles is just, ugh. Um, I can't remember which player it was, but it wasn't Luka, though, so, you know, it is what it is. But yeah, that's going to do it, y'all. Um, n not much to say other than this is the only game that was that is here and that is here for us to gawk at and look at, preview stuff like that. Unfortunately, so you know, um, we're gonna head on out here and that'll do it for this video. Y'all like, share, subscribe, and comment. Thanks.